Lake Street Dive, right here in the Bing Lounge. Greetings. Welcome to Portland. You've been here before. Yes, we have. A couple times, the Pickathon mm -hmm. and the likes. Yep. You know, I, I, mm -hmm. I, I did a double take when I heard these guys for the first time and saw their name was Lake Street Dive. Because, a bit of a personal note, I grew up in the Midwest, I grew up in Minneapolis, and Lake Street in Minneapolis is known for being a little seedy. It's kind of the seedy part of town. My wife and I got married really young. And the one thing I would always say before we got married, because I had my hesitations, uh, was that I just don't want to end up living in a dump on Lake Street. I don't want to live in a Lake Street dive. So I'm totally hip to you guys. Thank you. You understand. Love that. Love that. So what a breakthrough year. This, this year has been amazing for you guys. Yeah, it's been awesome. So glad that you can come. And, and maybe enlighten us on the, uh, the whole cool six degrees of Kevin Bacon separation that you guys have going. Well, we're still waiting for him to give us a phone call, but um, uh, he he tweeted a video of us, and it was actually it was sort of the first exciting thing of uh, that on the internet that had happened. You know, we'd put on we put like videos on YouTube and such, and and they'd been watched, and that was also very exciting. But you know, the world of Twitter and Facebook is like a rocket ship of things that we don't understand and it just one night I was like oh my gosh Kevin Bacon <laughs> tweeted about our video and it was right before a lot of stuff started happening so we don't know if it was the catalyst but we like to pretend it was yeah, it was shortly <laughs> after Katie Couric started tweeting stuff and then yeah so do you think spinning that, class do you think that the Kevin Bacon tweet had something to do with the whole uh T-Bone Burnett inviting into that that Ethan and Joel Cohn hootenanny thing that you guys played uh it it may have like you know by degrees led to T Bone, um, but I I don't know if that was like a direct connection. Um, but I I don't you know as Rachel was saying like Kevin Bacon led to like a larger audience for the band, which you know led to other people and may, maybe found its way to T Bone. I actually I do know that it was Gabe Witcher that told T, T Bone Burnett about us. So. <laughs> Um. <laughs> Track down that. <laughs> and, and, and try to paint that picture for us, because it's a pretty big deal, this Hoot and Annie. So, who were you playing with? Um, Elvis Costello was there. Yeah. Uh, Marcus Mumford. Um, Joan Baez. Joan Baez. Yeah. Uh, Connor Jack Obers, White. Jack yeah. White, Jillian Welch. And they're looking at you like, yeah, we're digging these guys. Uh, people, everyone there was really, really supportive and encouraging. Like, it was... Uh, it was an awesome evening. We were very nervous. Yeah. <laughs> I would imagine, though, after something like that, you probably went back to your rehearsal hall and you were a bit empowered. Kind of like, okay, this is going somewhere. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. I think the coolest thing about it for us was that, you know, T-Bone Burnett surrounds himself with people who were not only good musicians, but good people, it seemed, you know, it's like, we didn't meet a single soul there who wasn't, you know, just really, that was approachable, and able to, you know, be it Joan Baez, or Marcus Mumford, it was pretty incredible, and that was like, that was very hope-inducing, you know, for at least, you know, the trajectory, whatever it may be, that like, you know, people can be successful and good at the same time. <laughs> You couldn't be further from the quintessential Lake Street dive if you tried, right? Hey. In name only. That's what you're all about. We're glad you're here. Tonight they'll be at the Wonder Ballroom. Brand new album. The name of the new album is? Bad Self-Portraits. There you go. Yeah. There you go. Let's bring them back. Late Street Dive here cool. in the Bing Lounge.